Welcome to your Catholic Daily News Briefing, a service of Catholic News Agency. Listen on your smart speaker or wherever you get podcasts. The leader of the Ukrainian Greek Catholic Church said on Thursday that women are becoming the first victims of the occupation of Ukraine and warned that some women are becoming victims of violence and rape. More than three million people, mainly women and children, have left Ukraine since the full-scale Russian invasion on February 24. Three aid workers for a Catholic charity operating in Ukraine sustained head injuries last week when the van they were riding in was hit by artillery fire. The men were delivering food and supplies close to the Russian lines to Ukrainians trapped by the fighting and planned to evacuate a group of children on the return trip. After leaving the hospital, the two men who were less seriously hurt said they were ready to rejoin the humanitarian effort. A new survey of black Catholics in the United States has found that black Catholics are significantly less likely than other Catholics and also less likely than black Protestants to attend a church where most of the other parishioners are of the same race or ethnicity they are. About 6% of the black population in the U.S. around 3 million total people is Catholic, compared with some 66% who are Protestant. Black Catholic communities in the U.S. include not only African Americans, but also African and Caribbean immigrants. They make up about 4% of all Catholic adults. Today, the Church celebrates St. Patrick. He was captured and brought as a slave to Ireland before escaping back to Britain, but later returned to Ireland as a bishop to minister to the small Christian communities. Using the traditions and symbols of the Celtic people, He explained Christianity in a way that made sense to the Irish and was thus very successful in converting the natives. He remains one of the most beloved saints of Ireland. Thanks for joining us. For more, visit catholicnewsagency.com.